Hey everyone, today I'm going to solve a physics problem, and here is the question. So, first, for part A, we have to evaluate its position at t equals 3 seconds. So, for part A, we just simply plug the time volume into our equation, so our position will equal to 3 times, time is 3 seconds squared, so it will be 27 meter. And for part B, we just plug into our time value again. So x equals 3 parentheses, 3 plus delta t squared. And we simplify this, we'll have 3 times 9 plus 6 delta t plus delta t squared parentheses. And we have 30. 27 plus 18 30 t plus 3 30 t square and then part C we have to evaluate the limit limit of 30 t approaching to 0 dirt x over delta t so delta x is final position minus initial position so Final position is going to be come out from part B. So we have 27 plus 18 30t plus 3 30t squared. And initial position is going to be from part A. So it's minus 27. And the final time is 3 plus 30t. And the initial time is 3, so minus 3. And simplify this, we'll have limit as 30 approaching to 0. 27 minus 27, we get 0, so we have 18 delta t plus 3 delta t squared over delta t. So because 30 is approaching to 0, so 3 30 squared is approaching to 0. Uh, mm, okay, I'm going to do this way. So we're going to simplify this again. 30. So we have 18 30 t over 30 t plus 3 30 t squared over 30 t and back cancel it out so we'll have limit as 30 t approaching to 0 where 18 plus 3 30 t and because 30 is approaching to 0 so we will have finally 18 meter per second so this is going to be our velocity at t equals 3 seconds.